Well, what's my tramp stamp gonna say? <laughs> I love crime and stealing things. <laughs> Okay, hey folks, this is a pretty straightforward, simple job here today. But I figured I would film it, because I've been doing kind of a lot of um, sort of boring jobs lately, so I haven't been filming that much. Film this one and hopefully something cool happens. They're developing this lot, they're building a house here. So we've got this cottonwood, got some bad included bark in it. I'm surprised it hasn't split out yet, but it's gotta go. They're gonna put a retaining wall right there, right where the roots are, so. I got Randy here to help me, and uh, we're just gonna burn all the brush here. Brought my bucket truck. Just got these sweet Hawaiian shirts and now it's cold and wet <laughs> and rainy every day. So this, <clears throat> this is the other part of the job. We're probably gonna do this. We're gonna start with this first because the the road isn't busy right now. Um, these two trees have to go as well. We, actually, there are three trees here. We've got a locust right here and we've got a, a fir right here. I keep forgetting, I, you know, I just got this bucket truck. I keep forgetting, I gotta put like traffic cones and stuff on it i keep like just like a million things you don't think about um so i don't have any cones or anything but i'm gonna park in that lane and uh, i'm gonna do that right now because this is the least busy time of day and i'm just gonna try to knock these out quickly and randy's going to squirrel up this guy this is another black locust <clears throat> and it's uh really tall and gangly and skinny <laughs> it's, it's kind of it's all up in this fur it's kind of a, a tricky one. But yeah, the tree service stuff is going pretty good. I've got my truck and uh, my chipper, and I've just, I've actually been staying kind of busy um, with contract climbing and my own tree jobs. You got any chocks on your rig, or you want me to put chocks down? I've got pieces of wood. That I've yeah, got. that's what I did for a <laughs> yeah. long time. I'm, st I'm saving up for the rubbers. I have no idea, I'm not the guy. I'm, I'm just the worker bee. Oh. <laughs> we spill oil everywhere, Randy. <laughs> Is that your first time doing that? <laughs> All right. Are these donuts? Time to. Anybody? What? These donuts or just? Did you put them there? No, the the dude put them there. I'm on are that you, uh, the carnivore the still. Yeah. How's still that doing carnivore. for you? Good. Yeah. I've, I've lost like eight pounds. This doesn't make your mouth water. <laughs> it looks pretty good. <laughs> I lost like eight pounds. That's awesome. Yeah. I'm eight pounds of joy. See if I'll treat myself after this tree. <laughs> well, you going gonna... down into the road right now? Yeah, I'm gonna go break the law. Time to time to break the law. I'm a real tree service. Look at me breaking the law. <laughs> oh, look at this. I got strobes. Now I'm legal. Oh. I'm not blocking the road. I have strobes on. So good. I'm gonna do this so fast though. I'm gonna do it before any cars drive, drive by. You should look at my harness. I got one of these harnesses. It doesn't even. It's not. It's not even like trying to figure out how to undo a bra. It's like it just makes sense. Really. But yeah, I got it from the Sappy Supplies. Yeah, I like the outside scabbard a lot. We got it at Sappy Supplies. <laughs> <laughs> I am right in the middle of the road. <laughs> At least we got that nice guilty of trees and cone that you stole. That's a true friend. Yeah, real friends steal things for each other. <laughs> Hashtag deep life. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> 
sounds like <laughs> it's pretty random. But he like a donut. <laughs> Dude, do you think they we could at least get a burger? <laughs> This guy's just got cows in his yard. Man, I really want to be done working on this road. <laughs> die sometimes though. You just, you just want, you, you just want, you just want to see me. <laughs> I just want to go down to the down there. Like, the bucket will be close. Uh, what do you think if you got pulled up closer where your turret's in the middle? You'd probably gain another 10. 30 feet. Yeah, yeah, 40, 50, 60. <laughs> I can't go down anymore. Okay. Yeah, I can't reach it. Sorry, Randy. No, you're good. I'm just there's always that fur. You know, we could just hang a rope in that fur and cut it at the base, you know? If you wanted to get really crazy. You can cut that branch out too. It's all up in your face. <laughs> Waving my bucket all over the place. Singing, we will, we will block you. <laughs> There's a school bus coming. Could you just stand in front of my truck and just act like, I don't know. Dude, you know who I miss? It's Lucas. He's been out of town all week. That guy just took orders. Oh. <laughs> like after work, I have to go ship orders. You've been pushing paper. Pushing cardboard. Pushing cardboard, huh? Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, man. I got really uh, accustomed to not shipping orders. I, mean, I don't know how you do it so fast and snappy. <laughs> Shh, no one knows. But I pretty much don't sleep. Yeah. <laughs> I just don't sleep. That was stupid. You know, even though I'm breaking the law, blocking this lane, it sure beats climbing. <laughs> it feels good, doesn't it? <laughs> it's definitely worth it. Like you get to, you fix a sawn down a tree and breaking the law. Right, I mean, your tree would be easy, but. Yeah, <laughs> yeah it's, you would've been done by now, I, I know. <laughs> no, that thing goes up forever, man, I don't know. It is a string bean. It's very nimble, but I have a few more pieces to go. Cut my life into pieces. This is my traffic cone. <laughs> it does become yours after you use it. I went over there, walked, used all this energy to get it. 
getting a little nimble up here. I get done first and then Mitch watches this video and then he'll rue the, rue the day he ever said you were a faster climber. <laughs> no he won't. Now I'm, now I'm in go mode. <laughs> oh Mitch is watching? <laughs> Goodness gracious, great balls of fire. Oh, that's a that's a hefty piece. Hey Jake. Yeah. What now? <laughs> Before I just want to let you know my plan because you might be able to help me from the bucket. So I'm gonna lower this out, have them, but I'm gonna send this top kind of into that and lower it and then it'll like so it's kinda because I'm gonna I'm gonna lower it off itself, but it's to keep it, you know, it's way too string being for me to Oh, you're doing that little guy. Yeah, I'm gonna do the little guy first, and then I'm gonna do the big one. That way it's not in the way. <laughs> it didn't go. <laughs> Cut more. <laughs> what in tarnation? All right, it's gonna just shear off and do some be a horrible place to live, Tar Nation. All right, let's lower that down so I can. Nice. Another school bus. What is going on? It's like. It's like kids want to learn or something. <laughs> Nothing makes me madder. Makes me even <laughs> more furious. All right, I'm going for it. There's a school right down the road. Great. Great. Okay, welcome to the rodeo. Just gonna have Patrick drag this stuff out with the machine. I'm gonna drag it out. <laughs> Hands up! What? Breaking the law, breaking the law. It's so cool breaking the law. I went 65 here. Should get a tattoo. Should get a tattoo that says I, I'm a lawbreaker. <laughs> I break the law and steal. Yeah. <laughs> get it tattooed on my lower back. <laughs> now we're talking. <laughs> That's a tattoo we all can get on board with. Oh, Heads!
What do you feel when you're done doing that illegal stuff? Uh, you, I get to try out that shredder of a saw. Yeah, yeah. I always use this saw when I gotta break the law. Because <laughs> it's so fast. Breaking the law, breaking the law. You like breaking the law? Well, if you mean talk, parking your bucket truck in the middle of the road, then yeah. <laughs> I love breaking. I love... <laughs> yeah. Hey, I got this saw for you, big guy. What uh, what happened? The neighbors? Oh, this neighbor's grumpy. I like your Petzl OK carabiner. I sell those at Savvy Supplies. You know, this whole stealing thing, I could really maximize my profits if I just stole the, the gear I sell. You could. I believe that's 100%. <laughs> oh, shoot, dude. I didn't know you were so good at math. No, well. Yep. <laughs> I can't believe how fast the saw cuts. It's so cuts. It's so like, crazy. I have, I have my little 210. Yeah. But that cuts way faster. <laughs> this like, thing is insane. That cuts like a full size saw does. It does, yeah. It's like shocking how fast it cuts. Well, what's my tramp stamp gonna say? <laughs> I love crime and stealing things. <laughs> you wanna do the cutting down here to get a clear path? Or I'm a little taller, I might be able to reach some of those nubs. I care if I start start cutting. Yeah, that'd be great. Micro flip, Petzl micro flip. Is that a steel core too? Yeah, it is. I was trying to find an alternative to the Stelio because I oh, okay. have a trouble keeping them in stock. Is that one pretty good? But now I have like five of the five meters in stock. Yeah, it's pretty good. It's not as flexible though as the Stelio. I like the Stelio better. I just keep this one in the bucket truck. Don't look down on me. I'm bringing a rope. Oh, <laughs> a rope climber. <laughs> well, now I can't like relax and be comfortable though. Like no, without my rope, without my rope. Well, I'm like, I can't like just sit down on my harness. Mm -hmm. Call me old fashioned, but uh, <laughs> I do like the rope climbing. That's what I mean. I keep forgetting crap. I'm like, okay, I got everything. And then I get here and like, don't even have a climbing line. In my oh, truck. You, you didn't, that's why you don't have one? Yeah, no, I, <laughs> I'm just in a law breaking mood today. <laughs> no, yeah, I, I don't have a climbing line in my bucket truck. I, I took it out for some, who knows why. I don't. I don't even know why. Because you don't need a climb line for a bucket. <laughs> yeah. So actually, if you wouldn't have come today, I would have been pretty screwed. <sighs> You're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> Face cut or nothing, I can just blast right through the <laughs> <I'm coming after. laughs> No. No matter how fast you are, I'm just gonna claim I hey I did part of that removal too. <laughs> Oh, I gotta do some stuff on now. Yeah, I gotta rope. look really cool. Should I not use a rope and go rope, on rope that? Pump. You should take yours out like I did. <laughs> should I just no. walk out that? Yeah, I would just uh, ditch the flip line. <laughs> just ditch everything. <laughs> <laughs> this guy's a maniac. I must say, this is a pretty light setup. Oh, <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> rope was climbing. Never climbing with a rope again. Mark my words. <laughs> I'm just like 
like shocked at how fast the saw cuts. I feel like with these top handles, even just a muffler mod makes a huge difference, you know? Yeah. I feel like the mufflers really restrict them. <laughs> Uh, I'm looking at this branch right here like, man, am I going to smash that uh, shed with this? If I did put a rope over my demo, I would climb with rope. I swore an oath I would never climb with a rope again in my life. Never again. I think I can miss it. I just got to get it to hinge like an inch. <laughs> I, I don't know what the deal is with cottonwood. It's so weird because I feel like from the ground it actually hinges pretty well. But up here it really doesn't. <laughs> yeah, but it. like on the stump, it's not too bad. Wow, that kind of works. Toppies at the same time? Yeah, yeah. Mine was especially cool. <laughs> <laughs> Come here, come here, you little, you little, little doofus. <laughs> One more. Thanks, Randy. Yeah, man. Now, if you didn't spend so much time helping me, you'd probably be done. Ooh. Yep. Ugh. Oh, dude. Oh. That was like between my legs when I jumped. I have to call my wife. Sorry, honey. Randy totally just demolished my cross. <laughs> I didn't hear what. So you finished first. Yeah. Way faster. That one was Patrick way says I'm way faster. <laughs> he, <laughs> I had, he nothing got the to, really hard side. had nothing to do with my easy drop zone. <laughs> Dude, we could probably fall that thing now yeah. with the rope that you got in it. <laughs> Definitely. Pull it down. What's that? Uh, we're talking about uh, like, should we? We could probably pull it over now because he skinnied it up. We just have to move the trailer. But uh, is it pretty easy to move that thing? Yeah, I just, I just hook the chain of the bucket and I'll just drag it forward. Yeah, we just fall it. Or you can lower the top. It doesn't matter to me. It's up to you. You got the options. I guess I'm just frustrated that you're still up there. You know? <laughs> you're not. You're not home already. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Just piece it out then. 
probably be faster, honestly. Yeah, let's do it. Let's just fall it. I like how you had to use two ropes in yours and I used no ropes in mine. That's crazy. <laughs> All right. Yeah, can, can we move that trailer? That's great. <laughs> Wait, what? what just happened? There's a there's a LaCroix machine up there. <laughs> nah, dang it, I got the wrong side. I brought 50 cents and I got one. <laughs> with uh like with the machine? Uh maybe yeah, that would be good. That, that uh, weighs 13,000 pounds, so. Yeah, it'll definitely yard it over. That would be great. Just like where do you want me to set up at? Like right like right here. Okay. Would be good. And we'll just get it taut, like not super tight. And then I'll cut it and then you can just rip it over. <laughs> Did you, are you hungry at all? It's a meat stick. Oh wow, that's quite the meat stick. <laughs> yeah. It's a, it's, I guess it's hot. <laughs> but oh, wow. Do you want some of it? Sure, yeah. That looks meaty. <laughs> <laughs> Give me that meat. <laughs> there we go. It's all that now. Yeah, what, what do you think? I saw it one end, you saw it. If you want to break it off? Sure. Yeah, break off that. Break me off Thanks. a piece of that meat stick. <laughs> what kind of meat is that? Horse. <laughs> it's part of the neighbor's cow from earlier. <laughs> yeah, do you want to back up a little bit? I'll just tell you when to stop. Yeah. Okay. Okay, 500 I. I got a 2511 and then I got a, a rancher and I've got Nick porting me a ported 2511. They're all saws I'm gonna give away at various times. Probably next month, I think. <laughs> Yeah, go ahead and just yard it over. Drive fast. fast? Yeah, just go for it. Yeah. Yeah, that's the next giveaway saw. <laughs> well, I, I'm giving a saw away every month for a year, so I'll probably do a 500 towards the end of, <laughs> I don't want to start out with the 500. How much is a 500? Like 1600 bucks. Yeah, it's not too bad. How do you like it in comparison to like the, uh, your other saw, your, what, do you have a- I have a 462. Yeah. It's probably my closest saw. This thing has got so much power. It's really, you want to try it? Yeah, yeah I do. Is, there's no, I do. yeah, it's super easy to start. There's no. <laughs> that spoil you quick. Plus it's, it's like not, it's light. Yeah, it's only 13 and a half pounds. It's a 
<laughs> yeah, it's like a laser beam. Yeah, the, it's... Are, the power ratio is just incredible. Well, plus the chain yeah. is so damn sharp. Yeah, the that's that's that square ground chain. Yeah. Thanks, guys. Yeah, no problem. It was fun. Oh, thank you no problem, thank for being you. so polite. All right, well, uh, well, that's it for this video. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. Check out my store. My online store, uh, sappysupplies.com. If you need any arborist gear, I uh, spend every dollar you spend at the store enters you to win a chainsaw. I'm giving away a saw every month. And also, if you see any comments, I, I keep getting bombarded with these uh, comments. These people, they, they take my profile picture but they change the name slightly, so it's like guilty of treason one or something. And they'll like be like, congratulations, you're the winner of a new iPhone. Text this number on Telegram or whatever. And uh, they just there are so many of them, it's hard for me to delete them all. And uh, I've had a couple people actually get scammed and they email me and uh, people email me constantly last week. Hey, is this real? It's not real. If I'm doing a giveaway, I'll announce the winner like in a video or on my site, Sappy Supplies, but I'm not commenting on people's posts really sucks maybe if you guys are watching this if you uh you see any comments like that maybe reply to that comment and say this is a scam that'd be really helpful for me because it's hard to hunt all the comments down and delete them all the scamming comments really frustrating but anyways if you want to win a chainsaw you just have to spend any amount of money at sappy supplies and once again thanks for watching guys i'll uh i'll see you later